What are your thoughts on uh, just facing this Bulls team in a little bit similar situation, young roster, that sort of thing? Uh, yeah, um, our thoughts are the same. Uh, we're just trying to be the best we can every day. Um, we lost the last two, uh, so we're trying to get back on the right side of the category. Um, I know we have a lot of guys out tonight, but uh, Coach's message to us is basically just worry about ourselves, not worrying about who's out, um, who's not playing, uh, just trying to be the best we can be. You're, uh, you're really close with Drew. What do you think about the way he's kind of handled all of the speculation and all of the talk about you know him being involved in all these trades and stuff like that? Uh, I mean, Drew's the best. Uh, he's literally like the he's the best team that you could ask for. Um, he's so supportive of everybody here. Um, and obviously, there's a lot of talks with trade stuff, but um, he doesn't take any of that into the locker room or into the court. Uh, so he's just a joy to be around. Cal, how many tickets you got to give out tonight? Not many. I mean, my first time coming to Chicago, I probably got like 70 or 80, but that was the only time I ever did that. And, now I just tell my family, you know, you see the schedule when the, you see the schedule, so to get your own tickets ahead of time. <laughs> <laughs> is there still something special about coming back? Huh? Yeah, that's all it is for sure. Um, I've been to so many games here uh, as a kid, you know, watching watching the Bulls. So being here, um, even just doing shit around, it's always just bring good memories. How do you feel personally, where you are in your career, the way you bounced back? How do you feel? Um, I feel good. Um, I think I, I just take pride in. Trying to handle every situation uh, the right way. Uh, and just being a professional, uh, just it's definitely challenging. Uh, it's not where I thought I would be, but um, just in terms of being a professional, I take a lot of pride in that. I'm just coming here, um, trying to have a smile on my face and be a professional. Can you talk about Zion and what kind of talent you think he is and playing with him? Yeah, um, I've never seen anything like Zion. It's, uh, it's really surreal. Uh, you guys have just seen uh, the start of it. It's it's scary uh, how good he is. Uh, I mean, obviously he's only 19, but I've literally I've never seen anything like it. Your coach says it kind of brings a different energy to this team in different cities and guys around the road. Do you feel that as well? Yeah, for sure. Uh, just from he's such a big deal, um, and I think we forget it to wear around him every day. But when we go to you know other cities and we see you know kids streaming, uh, he's like he's a rock star. Um, but I think we forget about it just because how how well he handles it. Uh, he comes in every day. He's really just a 19 year old kid uh, with with a lot of fame. Um, but he's, 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 he's the best. What, what have you seen from him in adjusting some of the, the smaller lineups that you guys have been using with him? Um, what else in Zion? Yeah. Um, just the versatility that everybody knew about. Um, he knew so much on the floor. We benefit just having him on the floor. Um, so he could, he could play the five, he could play the three. Um, he can do everything on the court. So uh, he obviously makes us a lot better. We're happy to have him back.